Hey friends, I'm in my kitchen and I'm going to make some Earth Day art. Earth Day is April 22nd and this is super fun and I think you should try it if you have the supplies at home. So I'm going to use shaving cream to make a globe and I'm going to use food coloring, blue and green, for the colors of the earth. It's going to look really cool. You should also cut some paper ahead of time. I cut mine to be round like the earth and I cut like two or three. I just use like a bowl as a stencil. So my paper's ready and I've got my shaving cream and I just need a layer of shaving cream. You can do it on the counter or on a cookie sheet and then you need to get it smooth and flat. This is the fun part. It's touching the shaving cream but trying to give yourself like an even layer of cream to put the food coloring. I gotta wipe off my hand. Okay, now you drip a little bit of blue. You could use paint for this too, but if you know me from last week, I don't have any paint at home yet. I gotta work on that. All right, now a couple of green dots, and then something to swirl it with. You're gonna make it look marbled. So I've got this wooden skewer, you can use a butter knife, and you want to drag the shaving cream through each of your colored dots. You can swirl it any way you want. It's really fun. You can even use your finger. It does stain your hand though if you're using food coloring. All right, it smells really good. Now I'm going to use my circle paper and I'm going to print the food coloring on the paper. So you just put your paper on top and you kind of smash it down into the food coloring and into the shaving cream. Make sure it's touching all your colors. And then when you pick it up, you'll be picking up the colors that you marbled on top of the shaving cream. It's really cool. I'm going to put this one to the side and I'm going to make a second print with the same shaving cream. So let me put this over here. All right, I'm gonna swirl it a little bit more. And it's okay if it gets all lumpy. You can just smooth it out again. But the more you swirl it, the more the colors start to blend until pretty soon you only have teal. But if you love teal, that's okay too. But I want it to look like the earth, so I gotta leave a little bit of white. All right, so this is print number two. I didn't add any new food coloring, I just swirled it over again. And it still works really, ooh, I like that one better. So keep trying and have a lot of fun with this. Earth Day is April 22nd. I glued mine onto a black background and then I used paper bag people that I cut out of the paper bag and I added a big heart. This is gonna be a gift for my neighbor cause she's a nurse and I'm really grateful for all her work. Oh, and my heart is six feet wide. <laughs> I hope you're safe and healthy, and I'll see you soon.